Hey guys, my name is Dr. Frank. I'm the founder of the program Addiction Mindset Become Obsessed. And if you're watching me on YouTube, chances are that you found me on TikTok or Instagram and I kind of funneled you over to my YouTube channel because you're looking for advice on addiction. Specifically, I usually focus on nicotine, THC, or high concentration energy drinks, right? Highly caffeinated energy drink products. So let me tell you a little bit about who I am and what addiction mindset is and what it means to be part of the addiction mindset family. So a little bit on my story. When I was 16 years old, I had my first cigarette. I remember it was a camel cigarette. Didn't really like it. Then around the age of 17 or 18, I got into chewing tobacco. This chewing tobacco had my heart. This was my addiction. Um, skull mint pouches was my go-to choice. And I chewed, you know, I chewed two, two pouches of tobacco three to four times a day, sometimes maybe more, that would deliver me 12 milligrams of nicotine or more at a time. So I was really hooked on nicotine. Um, there was a point where I tried to quit chewing tobacco where I started to vape. Uh, that never really stuck with me, but I certainly didn't quit. And then I would go through phases where maybe I'd have a cigarette, chewing tobacco, vaping. It was really just a disaster when it came to nicotine addiction for me. And this lasted about over the span of 10 years, um, maybe, maybe even uh, yeah, 18 to 28 years old. I really struggled really, really bad with nicotine addiction. And, and I always tell people I wanted to quit for nine of those years. Um, every morning I would start off my morning with an energy drink. I liked Monster. This is a prop for another video that I'm doing, but I liked the sugar-free Monster energy drinks from the age of 18 to 25. I had one a day every morning. You couldn't talk to me without me having an energy drink in the morning. Um, sure, throughout college we had some binge drinking going on and then THC usage as well was a pretty common place. So a lot of people on my TikTok, they're like, Dr. Frank, but dude, you don't even smoke. You haven't even tried nicotine. You don't get it. No, I do get it. I really, 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 really get it. And that's when addiction mindset was born. It was about two years ago, I realized just how well I got it. I wasn't happy with my life anymore. I wasn't happy with myself. I wasn't happy with my personality, my behaviors. My ambitions were really going out the window. I just wasn't doing as well as I had thought I would in life. And I quickly realized it was these addictions that were holding me back. They were causing me mass amounts of depression and anxiety. Uh, the nicotine was affecting my brain in ways that I never thought possible. It was really just a horrible, horrible experience that I had. And one day I woke up to it and I said, I never want other people, I never want you, you, you who's listening to this to go through the nine years of hell that I went through. I say, I wish I would have gotten sick in the first two years because I probably would have quit. Um, I suffered health consequences later down the line, but we'll talk about that in another video. But I said to myself, wow, I never want another person to go through this. And no one's really talking about adolescence and the nicotine addiction. No one's really talking about energy drink addiction or THC addiction. It's not things that we focus on. We're focused on cocaine and alcohol and opioids. But I really think these addictions are just as dangerous. If you didn't know this, Nicotine has been found to be just as addictive as heroin and cocaine. Do you know how hard it is to quit heroin and cocaine? That's a hard thing to do. Now, I'm fortunate I never dabbled with anything else. But just think about that. Nicotine has been said to be just as hard as heroin or cocaine. It's just as addictive. So where's the support for you guys? Where's the support for that? that kid or that young adult that's drinking an energy drink every morning, smoking weed to fall asleep at night, and you know just dosing nicotine all day long. That's what I made this group for. So listen, at the end of the day, that addiction took a lot of energy. It took a lot of work. That addiction took a lot out of me. It took a lot of effort to be addicted, right? When you're always walking around fiending for something, when you're always thinking about how to get your next fix, that takes a lot of energy and a lot of effort, and it's an obsession, right? You become obsessed with this stuff. It's like, oh, I have to have this. I have to have this. It's an obsession, and what I want to do is I want to take that obsession, and I want to help you guys put that obsession towards something productive, towards your goals in life. 
I want to help you guys refocus that obsession to something positive. Now, addiction mindset, the line become obsessed. That's the idea behind it. I want to take that addict mind. I want to take that addict energy and I want you to focus it into something positive. And that's really what addiction mindset is. It was born about two years ago when I was so disgusted with myself. I said, okay, if I want to help people, I'm going to have to, I'm going to, have to clean up myself. I'm going to have to cut this crap out myself. So I've been on a journey to try and figure out how to do that. And that's where we are today now. Now I'm trying to share that with you guys. So my program offers one-on-one -on -one coaching. That's a paid portion of the program. But content like this, free PDFs that I send you guys, I always have free portions to help you along the way. But a lot of you are going to need accountability. And that's where you can sign up for coaching and stuff like that if you want. But along the way, I give you guys everything you need to know on this YouTube channel, on my TikToks how to overcome some of these addictions. Now, as we grow, we're going to specialize in different areas of addiction. But right now, this is the main area of focus, THC, nicotine, and caffeine. So I'm really happy you're here. I'm really happy you're checking out the channel. There's going to be so much great content on here for you guys. Like I said, I'm going to give you everything I can to make sure you don't go through what I went through. Now, I'm going to make another video that explains the uh, the logo behind addiction mindset. See this logo right there? It's a hyena. That's a hyena head. And a lot of people are like, why did you choose a hyena? I'm going to explain that in another video. I got an elephant logo for the females. It has to do with building a community for us to support each other. Those of you guys who have suffered with addiction, those of you suffering with addiction, I want you to be part of my community. I want you to be part of my my pack, part of my group here at Addiction Mindset. We're going to support each other, we're going to work with each other, and we're going to achieve goals that we never thought were imaginable. I'm going to say this before I pop off this video. Listen, I think people who are addicted have the most potential in life. Like you listening to this, I think you have more potential than anyone because when you beat an addiction, you're doing something that people think they were never capable of doing. It is so hard in many cases to overcome that addiction. Many people will say it's the hardest thing that they've ever done in their life. And I really believe that myself when I look back at my, my struggles with nicotine and caffeine and this and that. And it was the hardest thing I ever did in my life. So once I accomplished that, I found myself saying, God, what aren't I capable of? What can't I do next? And I want that to be you guys. I want to see how you can overcome your addiction and then what you're going to do next. This is beyond just quitting. We're not just a bunch of quitters at addiction mindset. We're, we're quitting, but then we're going to accomplish something big. We're going to accomplish something amazing. And that, my friends, is addiction mindset. So be sure to check out the next video. I'm going to talk a little bit about why I chose hyenas and a little bit about the importance of a community when it comes to beating addiction. I'm so happy you guys are here. Stay tuned.